The following video is a fictional story. No CEOs were harmed in the making of this video. Meet Mr. CEO. Mr. CEO is about to find out why information security is serious business, and ignoring well-known advice could cost your business. Meet our ethical hacker, Steve. Steve is doing penetration testing for big company. Today he is leaving a fish stick, a simulated bad USB dropper on Mr. CEO's desk. Fish sticks can be disguised as USB devices and be paired with different payloads to demonstrate USB dropper attacks. Today Steve has paired his fish sticks with a keylogger payload. When inserted into target computer, fish sticks will use injected keystrokes to open up Windows Run and then types a one-liner that fetches the payload via Windows PowerShell. The attack is only visible for a split second on the victim's screen, so it is easy to miss. Fish sticks is now recording any key presses made by the user. So if the victim was, for an example, logging into his email account or any other service, those credentials would be compromised. The log data is stored in the temp folder of the victim and is then sent to the attacker. Fish Sticks removes the log data after it has been sent. The data is sent via HTTP post, so the attacker could be anywhere at this point. And there we have it. Steve got Mr. CEO's password. Good job, Steve. A few moments later. Falling victim to attacks like these could mean significant monetary losses for your organization. Or worse, there could be legal ramifications. If you'd like to know more about fish sticks, or would like to learn how to defend against bad USB attacks, go to our GitHub page. And if you liked this video, please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.